What's going on, everybody? See here, and welcome back to the, the far, far range with me, C1. We're playing some Slime Rancher. We're continuing the things, continuing the stuff. Hopefully, you're having a fantastic day. I'm having a pretty good day myself. Um, it's been a long day. Can't complain. Did the um, the Pokemon Go Fest today? Oh, it was an absolute. Well, at the time of recording this, did that today. It was an absolute blast. If you played, if you participate, leave a comment down below. I'm super curious. So, um, had an absolute blast. But uh, if you're more interested in that, you can check out the Discord and stuff. We can chat there. But anyways, we are back doing the things, doing the stuff. Okay, so. We've got these guys. Now, we need to mix our honeys with something here. Our honeys with something to make us some new bucks, some more money. We need the money. So what I am thinking is, uh, you know what we should do? Okay, I have an idea. Um, quantum slimes are worth a lot. Did we unlock this area? Yes, we did. Okay, so guess what? Oh, we've got, oh, we got these guys in here. All right, hold on. Uh, we need to clear these out. Oh, I know exactly what we're doing today. We're going to get quantum slimes. Oh, we're going to get some quantum slimes. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, I love quantum slimes. They're so much fun. Um, if you don't know what a quantum slime is. Oh, well, you are just in for a, a treat today, I got to say. Okay, so this area is cleaned up. Now, uh, the reason I want this area cleaned up is because this is where I keep my quantum slimes. And I'll tell you why later just trust me just trust me okay so let's go ahead i'm gonna go ahead and return the uh, the phosphor slimes back to their motherland that is the ocean because that's where all slimes originated from and let's go see if we can't get some quantum slimes i feel like we can oh hold on let me feed my guys first we gotta feed the hungry buddies we can't have the hungry buddies being hungry that's just not allowed Okay, the hungry buddies are no longer hungry. Let's go. So, uh, the quantum slime area. If you don't know where it's at, it is... Uh, actually, I think it's this area right here. Um, oh, we gotta open the gate. Oh, shoot. We gotta open the gate. Um, hold on a second. Okay. We've gotta open the gate. Now, you're probably, if you, you probably know what I mean by gate, but I, if you don't, I'm sorry. Um, I think we need a rock, a rad... I'm going to go ahead and grab a rad and a crystal. And then I think we're going to need a tabby and stuff, but I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Oh, we just, we just got to get, we got to get going. We got to get things done. I'm just, I'm ready. We've got Slime Rancher 2 right on the horizon. We must get, we got to get going here. I feel like we're taking our time. Our sweet, sweet time that we don't have. Um, I believe it's September. Is it September time? We're looking for, um, for the, for the... Slime Rancher 2 Early Access? I think it is. Oh, I'm so excited about this. Um, which way is the fastest way? I, well, I think I have to go through here regardless. Oh, you know what? It was faster to go through my cave. Hmm, yeah. Oh, wait, no. Hold on a second. Okay, if I go this way, we go this way, through the cave, through this, through this. I need to go right here. That's the door that I'm thinking of. Okay, so we need to get into... Okay, all right. I, I am all kinds of turned around. You know, one of these days we're going to open up this... Uh, we're going to open up this gate here, so I don't have to do that every time. But that's okay. Today is not that day. Today is the day where we continue jumping over it. Continue sneaking our way in. And... Uh, okay, let's go this way. So this is going to get us to our slime door and then hopefully from here we'll be able to open it uh, pink slime tabby slime we might we might be able to open it i don't know let's see all right slime key thank you thank you much appreciated all right so what do we need here we need here's the honey so let's go through the honey plort in there um oh we needed phosphor i mean i guess we could wait till uh Nighttime. There's rock. Here's red. And then we need phosphor and boom. Okay. So, no, we need one more too. Phosphor, boom, and. Is it tabby? Phosphor, boom, and tabby? Is the tabby right here? It is. Phosphor, boom, and tabby. Okay. Let's go back here. Let's grab the tabby. 
And then, actually, we should be able to grab a, the tabby and the boom over here. Are you going to eat something? Are you guys going to eat something? Eat that. Eat that hen. Somebody eat this hen. Hey. Eat that. Thank you. All right. And then we should have some booms over here. Hello there, boom slime. What do you guys eat? Meat? Oh, boom plot right here. Whoop. Okay. And it's going to be nighttime soon, so then we should be able to get our phosphor. Oh, easy enough. So, tabby port, boom port. And we'll get this bad boy open, and then we can go get our quantum slimes. Oh, I love quantum slimes. Oh, I love these trees, too. Um, these look like the... Um, these kind of look like the, the phase lemon trees. Like, just how they look. Like, if you kind of look... Like see how see how like you can see through? It's weird, right? Yeah, it kind of looks like the phase lemon trees. Um, oh, I guess we could probably go ahead and put these in then, huh? All right, boom. And then we'll do the tabby. And then we just need a phosphor. All right, so we'll go ahead and we'll hang out, wait for nighttime, grab ourselves a phosphor slime, and. Uh, Move on to the next area. Oh, so exciting. So exciting. Oh, there's a super secret style pack in here. We'll grab that. What's it for? Uh, oh, it's for the booms. They are arcane. The booms are now arcane. Very fancy. Very fancy indeed. All right, I think it's dark time. Is it enough dark time for... For phosphor slimes? Oh, phosphor slimes. Phosphor slimes anywhere? <gasps> There's a phosphor slime. Okay, what are you gonna eat? We eat that. No, 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 no. We eat this. No, you'll eat pogo fruit though. Come on, eat a pogo fruit. Eat a pogo fruit. Perfect. Get out of here. All right, we've got it. We've got the phosphor slime. Let's do it. Let's open the magical door. Actually, you know what? We should probably wait until morning time when we can actually see it. Because it's not going to be that majestic, you know? Uh, yeah, it'll be fine. We've never opened it at night. <laughs> we've never gone over in the under the cover of darkness, so... Something new and exciting. And uh, with... With Tars on our heels, like this could be the most exciting time to ever open a door. All right, where is that phosphor statue? Right here. Yes, silly little guy. You silly little guy, you. All right, there it is. Slime door. Oh. We've done it. My gosh, we beat the game. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. That's not the end. Not yet. Okay. Yeah, ancient ruins. All right. Hello, my friends. Hello. Hello, my friends. Okay, so here is our phase lemon trees. Um, actually, I need these because what I need to do is shoot one in there. Grab the phase lemon. Fantastic. We're good now. Um, actually, is there any more pogo fruit anywhere? No, okay. Briar hens, I don't need those. Hen hens, don't need those. Let's hit that, and let's actually go this way. I want to try getting some... F yes! Quantum slimes, hello, hello. Oh, I'm so glad you're here. And we've already got a phase lemon. Oh, look at that. Things are looking up for us right now, I gotta say. Okay, let's go ahead and get our map, too. Uh, One map. Hey, look at that. We got the whole area unlocked. Okay. Now. Curious. Curious. It's been a little while since I played this. So I'm not 100% sure how far we can actually get without... Oh, I, need about, I need about as many quantum slimes as I can hold. Um, let's go this way. I'm just going to grab all of you guys. Quantum plorts seem like they're always pretty, uh, pretty valuable. 
So I just like to grab a bunch of them, you know? And uh, we're gonna have them free range because free range quantum slimes are the, the really the only quantum slimes you can have. Uh, whether you want them free range or not, they're going to be. We got in here, heartbeat, okay. Now I'm actually kind of curious if we could make it all the way to the glass desert because I do have another slime key, but I, for some reason I feel like I needed, I thought I needed two slime keys in order to make it all the way over there. Let's see here. Do we need two slime keys or like, is that just some figment of my imagination? I'll take you guys. Don't worry. Come with me. If you want to have a life in solitary confinement. I mean, just kidding. It's, it's free realm. <gasps> no, I think we're going to be able to do it. Oh my gosh. We are going to be able to get all the way to the, to, to, to the glass desert. Holy moly. This is huge. This is momentous because the glass desert has the mosaic and the tangle slimes. It's so exciting. Oh, should we even go in here yet? I don't know. I feel couldn't I feel like I feel like I shouldn't go in here, but I, I feel like we must. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, did he grab five plorts just exactly perfectly to activate this teleport to go to the glass desert and make it here all the way? I don't know. Maybe uh maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. <laughs> Oh, this area is super cool. I love the glass desert. Um, okay, but we're not gonna we're not gonna explore it right now. I know, I tease you. I'm sorry. It's like, ooh, look at the glass desert. Just kidding. No glass desert for you. Uh, we're gonna head back with our quantum slimes. Actually, I'm gonna see if I can't find some more quantum slimes. And I want to because I want to get more more quantum plorts. And the way to get quantum plorts is with more quantum slimes. You see what I'm saying? There's, there is a connection there. All right, let's see. Okay, so I need, I need a tree like that one, but like one that has fruits on it that's like ready to go, but it won't drop them into the abyss. Okay, let's see. Do we have, do we have a tree up here maybe? Uh, <sighs> no tree up here. Also, no. Oh, I forgot the quantum slimes change color because I got the super secret style pack. So they're gray now. I was looking for little yellow dudes. And I was like, where are my little, where are my little yellow dudes at? Oh, they're not yellow. They're gray. <laughs> they're monochrome. Oh, let's go down in here. Oh yeah, hello. Come with me. Let's get you all out of here. I almost have a full inventory of quantum slimes and I'd like to make sure that I do have a full inventory of quantum slimes. Okay. You. 38, come on, we need like two more. And okay, we're good, we're full, we're full. All right, and I think there was a tree. Is there any fruit on the tree? No, did you guys eat the fruit off the tree already? Oh. Uh, so with the phase lemon trees, with the natural ones, in order to actually get the fruit off the tree, you have to see the fruit on the tree and then you have to shoot it with a different type of fruit. Basically, that fruit goes in a regular fruit and comes out of a phase lemon. However, if there's no lemons on the tree, you're not gonna get anything, right? <laughs> there's no fruit on the tree, you're not getting no fruit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's kind of funny how that works. But once you plant the tree, then it will just drop the fruit like normal. Um, all right, let's just head back. We've got the one tree right now. I think it'll be fine. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. We'll be all right. And then we'll just go ahead and plant from that. Oh, we got to hit the magical switch. Um, oh, actually, we need to go this way. What am I doing? There's a teleport right over here that will take us all the way home. And we're home. Voila. Okay, so let's see. Let's go ahead and let's get rid of our pink slime friend. Let's get rid of our pogo fruits. Let's make sure our slimes are fed. So that way in the morning we can harvest the plorts. 
and get all of the monies. Okay, everything's looking good. Let's go ahead. Let's sleep. Um, we have a mail from 7Z. Would like to extend a very special offer to you. An invitation to the very exclusive, exceptionally choice, highly sought after 7Z Rewards Club. The 7Z Rewards Club allows you to earn ultra premium ranks within an exclusive club for only a semi ultra premium price. It's just that easy. It's just that easy. <laughs> Each rank grants you a new club title along with a unique reward such as beautiful upgrades for your ranch, exclusive customization options, and more. We look forward to your enrollment, the 7Z Corporation, offering you a path to greatness, one large sum of new bucks at a time. All right, let's go ahead and sleep until morning. Return to ranch. Okay, so let's go ahead let's let's leave these guys alone for a minute and let's get this figured out over here so what we need what the plan is and how this is gonna work if you've never seen this before which i feel like everybody has uh we're gonna go ahead and throw a garden in here we're gonna upgrade the garden with a sprink we're gonna upgrade it with a sprinkler and a nutrient soil once we can afford both but i want to i start with the um i start with the sprinkler because it makes them twice as fast so phase lemon and then here's the magic part. You ready? Everybody's ready. Oh, there they go. Free range quantum slimes. All right. So the reason that we do this and the reason that you probably see a lot of people do this and everybody does it. I don't know. Maybe not. Is because quantum slimes don't stay in a pen. Um, you'll see that they like to um, they like to, to move around out of body uh, like this right there. That's not actually a quantum slime, but a quantum slime that's going to become a quantum slime from over there somewhere. He's gonna he's gonna quantum teleport over here. So um, you can't keep him in pens. There's no upgrades to keep him in pens. So what we do, and what I like to do, is I leave him in here. I let him free range in here. They pretty much never come up here. Um, they'll never get out there. They never get out there, and they never get out there. So you're pretty much good to go. And once this lemon tree starts dropping lemons, they're just gonna eat it naturally off the ground and ploop out their little plorts. And then we go through, replant the trees, have trees everywhere and get more quantum slimes in here. And it's just a fantastically good time. Um, so yeah, there's our quantum slime farm. Easy enough. But we need to, uh, we need to go ahead and make some money here. So let's grab these. Okay, so we've got a whole thing full of plorts here. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's hit up this. Is this? Uh, oh, it's chicken. He, he wants chickens. Stony hens in a roostro. Okay, hold on. Let's go ahead and sell these then. Are we? Are we good on the markets now? No, no, we're not. That's okay. I don't even care. We're just gonna go ahead and sell through them all. Oh, look at that. Thirty-four hundred dollars. Heck yeah. Okay, one, two, three, four, and a roostro. Hey, we actually had the stuff to do the things. Ta-da! All right, we gotta get these plorts picked up stat, though. You never, ever want plorts laying around on your farm because if a uh, slime ever gets out, that's dupl that's like, you know, part two slimes. Instant tar, your farm is gone. It's terrible, horrible, awful disaster. We don't have, we don't have the defenses yet, so. Okay. So now we're looking good. What does this button actually do? Oh, it just opens the Slimepedia and the plor market. Okay, cool. I don't know that I ever knew that that button actually existed. <laughs> yes, I'm sure I do. I'm sure I knew. Okay, so we have 43.94 uh, upgrades. Yes, air drive, get that. And then everything's good there. And then what we need to do up here is we need to get, um, let's go ahead and get nutrient soil and a sprinkler on both of these. Actually, let's do it on this one too. Perfect. Okay, so that's going to double the speed that they grow, and it's always going to make sure that they max yield. So, good stuff, good stuff. Okay, so that looks good. This looks good. Um, we could always do... We could always increase this stuff, too. Great for keeping chickens and, and hunger slimes out. Spring grass attracts scuttle bugs that chickens just love to eat with their bellies full. Hens will produce eggs twice as fast. Uh, the very latest in advanced poultry tech, the vitaminizer, bathes the chickens in a vita rays, allowing them to grow into healthy hens and roosters twice as fast. Ooh, should we go ahead and, ah, uh, you know what though? Am I going to have, I don't know that this is going to stay here, so I don't want to upgrade it yet. 
because I just I just don't know if it's gonna stay there. All right, and let's give these guys their mint mango. Fantastic. Okay, so I need we need Ogden. I need Ogden Ortiz. I need him to open up this thing right here. I need to go to Ogden's place because there's some garden upgrades that I'd like to get from Ogden, and I don't have them. Um, but let's see. As far as money goes, I think we're pretty much good. We could throw, let's see, we could throw the music box in these, but I'm not really worried about that right now. It's just kind of like a $500 luxury item, which we will eventually start doing, but not right now. Um, those look good. Oh, you know what? Let's go do the, um, let's go upgrade the garden in here as well. So that way it's putting off more lemons. Uh, nutrient soil. Now we don't do the scare slime because that'll scare uh, that'll scare the slimes away, and I don't want that. I want them eating right from here. Like that's that's exactly what we want. Perfect. Okay, so they're good. They're good. Everything's good. We're looking pretty good right now. We're uh, we're starting to come into the money here. Once we get these gardens going, once these things start, because I mean they're growing twice as fast, and they're gonna have a maximum yield every time now. So we're gonna get more per more per harvest. Um, so once we get those going, I actually have, you know, food constantly going in here. We're going to have some money coming out. Um, some decent money. Not, not bad either. I was hoping that we would be able to see the first, um, I want to see the, the first, the first phase lemon drop so we can get some quantum plorts. <gasps> oh, they're getting close. They're getting close. Okay. So I could take them off the tree now. However, I'm waiting for them to fall. Come on. I'm gonna sit here and wait and watch the fruit fall off the tree. I know, it's it's riveting. It's absolutely riveting. Oh, we got one falling. Oh, they went crazy. There's another one. Oh, they're going wild. Oh, it's like they're fish animals. Look away, we gotta watch. Oh my gosh, there they go. They're eating, they're exploding, they're plorting, they're everywhere. Cover, cover your eyes. There's plorts dropping. Oh gosh, another fruit just dropped. We must stand back as we watch them. <laughs> you know, it's so funny how, uh, how quickly they go after that stuff. Like, man, if these were piranhas and they wanted to eat me, like I'd be done for it. Oh, I'd be done for in no time. Okay, so another tip, another little thing right here. If, if you're gonna try to do this and if you've never seen this for some reason, you don't want to mix these with anything. Um, the reason you don't want to mix this with anything is because if they are a single slime, you can you can suck up a single slime like that, right? Putting your inventory. However, if it is a Largo, if it's two slimes mixed, you can't do that. It's, it stays suck, stuck to the front of your back thing. So the reason for that is so you can run through here and suck up all of these plorts nice and easy like, and then if you suck up any of the, um, if you suck up any of the quantum slimes, you just spit them back out. So never mix them just let them do quantum slime stuff and uh yeah they're gonna be happy in there oh <laughs> man they were ferocious okay let's go see what these will sell for now maybe we should wait a little bit 78 now nah, they're on the downward trend anyways let's just go ahead and sell them now perfect easy peasy i'm loving it it's fantastic we got more food coming in here which means we have more money so what i want to do next is uh, well, we can't really, oh, hold on. We got somebody here. We can't really do anything until we get, uh, do we want Moki? Do we want Victor? Um, honestly, we can't unlock Victor until we unlock Victor and do so much slime science. So let's do Moki that my toast is in a jam here. Help a pal out, would you? Um, two quantum, really? Really? I just got rid of my quantum plorts. Like, I literally just threw them into... <sighs> well, I guess we could try to go get another quantum port. Maybe we missed one. Maybe I missed... Oh, wait. Actually, I need two, don't I? Maybe I missed two. What am I going to get? I'm going to get a thousand and some chickens for that. Heck yeah. Um... So yeah, I want to get, um, I really liked, I would like to get Ogden in there so we could go do some garden upgrades because I really want to do some garden upgrades. Let's see if I missed any plorts down here. You know what? They eat fruit. 
um and the phase lemon is their favorite fruit so if i just bring them a fruit of something else they'll eat that we'll do that okay what are the odds that there's even going to be like pogo fruit left over here okay i see that tree oh i see a whole bunch on the ground get out of here no go away no they stole it all those hungry little thieves all right, we'll begin. <laughs> we'll go feed these store quantum slimes. We'll finish off uh, the Moki Miles one. Now, I don't know how many we have to do in order to unlock her place, but I know with Victor, we have to talk to him. We have to do the mission with him, but then we also have to do so much slime science, I think as well. So um, that's why I'm not super worried. Hey, are you hungry? And where did you just go? Are you hungry? Really? You're not going to get in there and eat this? Okay. Where did you... Where did you... Oh, he's over here. There's that one. All right. There's one and there's two. Fantastic. Okay. So that'll finish that. I don't know. Maybe it's just one. Maybe we can... Uh, maybe we go check out Milky Miles stuff now. Hey! Um, drop the cube berries. Grab the chickens. Throw those in the pen over here. Wow, look at that. So many chickens. You know, actually, let's go throw the cube berries in with the um in with the quantum slimes, shall we? Oh, you know what? We got a star mail. Um, I bet you we have to read the star mail first. And then maybe we get access to her place. I don't know. I always thought Ogden was first, because her Oh, nope. Moki Miles, the stuff is right here. <laughs> it's activated all right let's feed these guys oh my gosh look at them very vicious piranhas it's like little cubes of meat <laughs> they're so hungry such hungry little buddies all right let's go ahead and grab these i want to sell these again because uh the market's about to drop now on these since i sold some today All right, I think that's all of them here. Freedom, quantum slimes, freedom. And money. Because that's what we're here for, to make lots and lots of money. All right, let's go ahead and read our star mail. Moki, the other ranchers won't shut up about you and it's starting to annoy me. So let's see what all the fuss is about. I'd like to talk business with you. So I went ahead and activated a spare teleporter in that horrible cave you called a ranch expansion. The teleporter... We'll take you to my state. I have others too, where we can work out the details. Don't keep me waiting. See you there, Square Moki Miles, Top Rancher. Um, and then Casey, the Death Hike. Hi B, do you remember when we took the when you took me hiking? I still don't know how serious you were about the whole outdoors thing. Then your idea of a hike just about killed me. I showed up in my normal clothes and shoes, and you were decked out. Had a pack of gear. It was a nightmare for me. I think it was around the five mile mark when I realized. When I was drenched in sweat and ready to collapse, uh, that I realized your ideas of fun were too... Oh, our ideas were two very different things. Also, you weren't even out of breath then, and I still totally hate you for that. <laughs> so, besties. I wonder how long it takes. So, like, they're a year away, right? So, she was, like, asleep for a year on a ship to come here. I wonder how long it takes the mail. I mean, it's digital, right? But still, like, it's got to take some serious time to get here. Um right maybe i don't know is there faster than light mail because if it took a year right if it took if it was a year like one light year right wouldn't it still take a year to receive like an email maybe not i have no idea this is beyond my scope i'm playing slime rancher for a living come on this isn't this is beyond my beyond what i do okay uh let's go ahead and feed these guys we'll feed the uh the aka aka to the other ones and uh, um okay that has never happened before how did you get out of here i have never had one of these guys escape ever that's so weird i've never had one of these guys escape ever in in the in the, all the time that i've been playing this game i've never had one escape Wow, that's a little scary. Okay, so what we're gonna we gotta we gotta fix that. 
we've got to ad address that situation like right now um let's go ahead and go to sleep and we'll come back okay what we're gonna try to do is i need to go and get some more of those phase lemons so hopefully they didn't drop on the ground okay they did not i need all of these phase lemons because i think what happened is if i put enough food down here they constantly come back to eat so i think maybe that's what it is maybe the maybe the phase lemons are pulling them keeping them like you know contained if you will okay so there's those and then you know what let's go ahead and throw one up here Actually, no, we're not. We're gonna we're gonna probably throw another silo up here. Actually, I'm just gonna throw the silo up here now. <laughs> we should throw an incinerator. <laughs> Any quantum slime that jumps into the incinerator, it's gonna get well incinerated. Okay, so that'll work. And then let's go ahead and just drop these in here, because I think if I keep these guys down there, see, like they're all running back over here now. I think that is what keeps them in here. I've never had one escape. That is so weird. That is so weird. I, you know, it's so funny because I was like, oh yeah, they never escape out of here. And it's like literally the first time ever. Um, I have, okay, 130 hours of, of gameplay into this, which is not a lot. Um, and I've never seen that happen. So leave a comment. Has that ever happened to you guys? Leave a comment down below. If you, if you use that as your uh, quantum slime cave, <laughs> have you ever had them like escape? I've never had that. Oh, it's crazy. But that is going to end this episode. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like here. If you're new, maybe consider subscribing as well for some more. I really do appreciate it. But anyways, we are going to continue on, continue doing the things and stuff. And hopefully in the next episode, I think either unlock the slime science area or, well, I guess we just unlocked Moki. So we might go do the Moki Miles stuff. We might go play with that in the next episode. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you want to see next. And uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and hop in on that. But have a wonderful, fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.